Yo, 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 uh, Scott here again, um, from Edge Math, and, uh, I'd like to talk some more about the common discrete math topic, um, so I'm using Venn diagrams to represent sets, so it's a very useful tool for a lot of different, uh, a lot of different types of questions, also very useful in the real world for, uh, some practical, uh, practical jobs or practical stats or some, uh, basic reasoning, uh, but let's look at, uh, Let's get a simple question, uh, relatively simple. Um, so suppose A and B are two different sets. Uh, we want to prove or disprove the statement that A minus B U union B minus A is the same as the union of A and B. Um, so let's draw out, let's use a Venn diagram for this. Uh, let's draw out a circle representing a, one representing B, so we've got A here and B here. Now let's look at, so A, this represents everything, everything inside this set A, and then B, the circle B represents every, everything inside of B. And then, so the part where the two overlap is, that's the intersection. So we can write that A intersect B. And then, let's see, let's look at these parts. A minus B. That's everything in A that's not in B. So here is A minus B. It's this part here. And B minus A. And let's look at the, so this is saying, this statement is saying A minus B, or the union of A minus B and B minus A is the union of A and B. So that's everything in A and B. Um, well, that's not quite true because we've got A minus B in here and B minus A in here. So A minus B is everything in A that's not in B. And then B minus A is everything in B, it's not in A. But the union of those, so this is not true because the union of A and B, I, A, U, B, includes A minus B, so everything in A that's not in B. Then B minus A everything in B that's not in A, and A intersect B. So it's not just A minus B and B minus A, it's also, it also includes A intersect B, so everything that's in A and in B. Now, how about, here's a, here's a second question we might see, so explain why this means that if A union B equals A minus B, explain that if the union of A and B is A minus B U B minus A, then the intersection That should be pretty clear from what we saw before because if A, A union B includes A minus B, B minus A, and the intersection. So if the union is just A minus B and B minus A, then that means there's nothing in the intersection. So intersection must be empty. So I hope that's clear. Um, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to leave a comment or uh, Ask me any other types of questions you would like me to answer. Great, and have a great day.